Welcome to the lecture on higher order differential equations. In this lecture, we will study linear differential equation. So, before going to the definition, see one example. Suppose if we consider z is a function of x. So, for example, z equal to x square plus 1. If we are differentiating this z with respect to x. So, x square derivative is 2x, constant is 0. We are using this notation dz by dx when you are differentiating z with respect to x. So, these type of derivatives are called ordinary derivative. See one more. So, z is a function of x and y. For example, z equal to x square plus y square plus 3. Now, we are differentiating this z with respect to x. So, x square derivative is 2x, but we are using the notation instead of this d we are using the notation do so do z by do x so this is called partial derivative so whenever the function dependent on single independent variable so that derivative is called ordinary derivative it depends on two or more independent variables that derivative is called partial derivative now what is a differential equation so, an equation which involves derivatives is known as a differential equation. The derivatives either partial derivative or ordinary derivative. So, see this example dy by dx plus 2y equal to x. This is a ordinary differential equation. So, this one is dou square u by dou x square equal to dou square u by dou t square. So, this differential equation is partial differential equation that means so generally we are dividing this differential equations into two types one is ordinary differential equation and second one is partial differential equation so ordinary differential equation means it involves only ordinary derivatives partial differential equation means it involves only partial derivatives ordinary derivative means it depends on only single independent variable here two or more independent variables now what is a linear differential equation so for a condition of linear differential equation so first condition is the degree of the differential equation is 1 the degree of the differential equation is 1 and the second condition is exponent of each dependent variable is 1 here the dependent variable is y so y exponent is 1 the exponent of a dependent variable is 1 and the third one is no terms as a product of y and dy that means there is no term the product of y into dy by dx if it satisfies these conditions then it is a linear differential equation first one is the degree of the differential equation is 1 second one is exponent of each dependent variable is 1 and no term is y into dy so see this one example dy by dx plus p of x into y equal to q of x it is a linear differential equation suppose if any differential is not in this any differential equation not satisfying these conditions that is called a non-linear differential equation see this example in this example the degree of the differential equation is 2 so that means it is not a linear differential equation so similarly in this example see in this in this the exponent of this dependent variable is 2 so therefore it is also not linear differential equation similarly in this so in this what is the why it is failed in this the degree of one term is 3 so therefore it is also a not linear differential equation these are all called non-linear differential equations so these are the reference books i used thank you